grab the controller, sit in your sofa, tell your wife it's game time, damn it! It's the Crying Gamer Show! What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? It's your boy, Crying Gamer, in the building, baby, talking that PlayStation VR, a piece of hardware that I am excited for. I cannot wait for this product to release by Sony. The release date is set for 10 13 2016 this year we'll be getting some new hardware to play around with on release date you will be seeing the unboxing of this unit you will be seeing some in-house gameplay of this unit but um i'm excited for this unit granted it is not the best resolution of all the vr headsets uh, when you compare to the oculus rift you compare to the vive those are you know by far the vive is just the king but Sony with the PlayStation VR coming in at a price of uh, the bundle which is 500 and the uh, core which is 400 um, the core the core is just a headset so if you have two PlayStation uh, move controllers you have the PlayStation I already camera you're good to go or if you just want to get extras personally I would go with the bundle the bundle comes with two controllers um, you have you get to have another camera it also comes with uh, the VR Worlds, which there's a lot of cool games, actually, that I want to play. They look awesome. We will get to that in a minute. Um, the VR, it's, it's comfortable on the head. I tried the unit, but I didn't, you know, I didn't record the, the footage of it. But it is definitely a unit that fits nice over your glasses if you wear glasses. Very nice and light. It is it's nice. It is not cumbersome at all um, compared to the Vive and the Oculus Rift. Um, what to say about that? I, I think this unit will be successful. A lot of people are doubting it, but I think a lot of money has been put into production and promotion of this unit. I think it's going to be successful if they do it right. They just have to make immersive games. And there's quite a few games, actually, that I'm looking forward to. Um, let's see. Right now, I'm looking for, let's put up on the board, Rush of Blood. Um, I think this game is going to be great. It's a real, it's a real horror game, real shooter. I love rail shooters from back in the day, and it seems like that this is what this is with your, your jump scares. The uh, VR, I think VR in general is just made for horror games, perfect for horror games in the uh, flight simulators. Um, what else? We got Resident Evil uh, 7, another horror game I think is going to do well with. You guys are familiar with it. If you played the demos available on, uh, on the PlayStation 4 for you guys to check that out. Moving right along, um, the games that I'm looking forward to also are on the PlayStation VR World's disc. The London Heist, I believe. I like what I see. Check it out in the uh, footage right there. Um, your job is to, you know, steal and to get away. So the way they bring the guns with the controller, you're doing the guns, you're shooting, you're aiming, you're dodging, with it, you're turning in the car, you're looking down, you're reloading. I like the way that looks. Looks like it's gonna be a good game, a lot of fun. Up next is Lunge, um, which looks fun as beep. Do my own sound effects. But um, you're, just, you're going down the street, you're lunging on your board. I think that is gonna be awesome. You're going in the car. I think the sense of speed, if they can nail it, will be an adrenaline rush when you play this game called Lunge. That's also on the PlayStation VR World's disc. So. That's why I say just, just you can buy the disc separately, separately on um, Amazon, or just get the package. There's no harm in having four motion controllers. There might be a game where you, you know where you need to use four controllers. Who knows? The camera, get an extra camera, give it to a family member, sell it, something. But I think it's a good deal to get that bundle, even if you have the two move controllers and, and a camera already. This Sony um, headset is going to be awesome. I think they're going to support it. With, they have, First of all, they have to support this thing with some AAA titles. It cannot be a demo station, an uh, indie station. They have to bring some AAA titles to VR for this thing to really, you know, have a stronghold in the market. Um, and I think Sony's going to do that. They're not in it to lose money. They put money behind this. So I think they will. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hit the subscribe button. Hit the like button. If you like the video, hit the thumbs up. If you didn't like the video, hit the thumbs down. It doesn't matter. 
Just do something, damn it. Until the next video, peace. So there you have it, gamers and gamerettes. Ladies and gentlemen, hit that subscribe button, slap that like button right across the face and leave a bruise so I can continue to bring you that footage that you need.